Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Muskan. So in today's videos, we are going to cover seven ways in which you can be an effective communicator. So let's get started with the video. Step one is practice active listening. Active listening means the more you listen to the people, the more you understand that what they want you to say and you can understand their opinions. And the things you grasp from them, according to that, you can frame your next statement in your mind that what you can say to make your communication effective. Two is to clarify your message. You should be very clear and be straightforward in what you are trying to say and what you are trying to ask from the person so that you will be very clear and concise while communicating that what do you want, what message do you want to convey and what they are understanding. So step one and step two is linked. Always listen to them and then convey a clear message. Three is non-verbal communication. Your body language, your facial expression, your tone of talking. Everything is a part of, you know, your communication. We don't get it, but these all combine. And so, you know, have these all in sync together. Your body language, your tone and uh, your facial expression everything should convey the same message because people in front of you may get what you're trying to say and what you're thinking are not aligned so be careful with that four is show empathy and trust you know sometimes things which are seen from your perspective could be different from what the other person is trying to see so you should just put yourself in their shoes and try to think for a moment what they might be feeling from their perspective because you are not in the same situation as them so you cannot understand what they you know must be going through so you must think uh, you know from other person's perspective before talking about the situation they are going through number five is asking open-ended questions questions which answers doesn't end with just yes or no if you want to get to know a person you need to ask the right questions then you will get the right answers number six is avoid interrupting them in the middle of the conversation i know people who are good at communication always want to speak their perspective but this comes to step one you should practice active listening first if you listen well you'll understand what the person is trying to say and then you can frame and follow all these steps so avoid interrupting someone while communicating Last tip is practice mindfulness stay in the conversation you know sometimes it happens when you start a conversation you dive into something related to your past through it and then you bring that in the situation so the person in front of you will be confused that why you know why it's striking right now maybe it has piled up with you and you know you relate that to the conversation going on right now but you should always stay in the present because the बात चल रही है आपको उसके साथ में ही रहना है and you need to speak up on those points only so practice mindfulness that will give you more perspective on having you know all of the seven steps together and have a effective communication from the person you are talking in front of you so that's all for this video guys please comment down what kind of videos do you need to see from my end that gives me more idea you know to create valuable content for you. I just don't want to create anything which's going on or which's trending on the YouTube. That's the reason I ask you people what kind of content, what are your daily problems you're facing so that I can bring a solution to that. That's all for the video guys. Have a great day and do subscribe to my channel if you found value through my content. Thank you.